more adults are seeking out treatment for mental health issues. The percentage of adults getting mental health treatment increased from 19.2% in 2019 to 21.6% in 2021. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention reported in data published this month. Those more likely to have received treatment? Younger adults, those aged 18 to 44, especially women in that age group, according to findings from the National Health Interview Survey, a nationally representative household survey done by the CDC. Participants who received mental health treatment were either on prescription medication for their mental health, in counseling or therapy from a mental health professional, or both over the past 12 months. Previous research has shown that symptoms of anxiety disorders or depressive disorders increased from 2020 through the beginning of 2021, especially among younger adults. This most recent survey also found that among adults aged 18 to 44, both men and women were more likely to have received any mental health treatment in 2021 compared to 2019. Abortion and mental health, uncertainty sits in on college campuses remote work, work from home leaves Americans feeling lonely and isolated it might be natural to expect mental health treatment would increase during 2020 and 2021 a period that included a nationwide shutdown to contain COVID-19 and T. Questions covered the 12 months prior to the interview. Interviews occur throughout the year, Schiller told USA Today. So when you look the percentages from 2021, they are definitely covering some portion of the pandemic period. Schiller from the CDC said the difference in mental health treatments between men and women aged 18 to 44 for all three years was striking. Women tended to have percentages that were about. It was interesting to see that the increase in the youngest age group from 2019 to 2021 was what was driving the increase for adults overall. Feel the urge to quiet quit? Colon time to check in with your mental health. Experts say we all get stuck, exclusive, Anderson Cooper more vulnerable than ever in New Grief podcast The percentage of non-Hispanic black adults who received mental health treatment went from 12.4% in 2019 to 17% in 2020, and 14.8% in 2021. Schiller said the decline in non-Hispanic black adults from 2020 to 2021 was in statistically significant. But it'll be interesting to see if the percentage for 2022 is lower and significantly different from previous years.